Hello, welcome into the uh, C2A tutorials. Um, we are going to talk today about um, how to display and use uh, the Arasbeam catalog. Um, Arasbeam is a catalog uh, of uh, BE stars uh, for which uh, uh, spectral observations are required. Uh, so uh, in C2A, uh, Arasbeam is seen as a dynamic catalog, which means that it is automatically downloaded from uh, the internet in a transparent manner for the user and um, it is uh, refre refreshed on a regular basis. So the uh, first thing to do is to go into the file menu, dynamic catalogs, and then in the uh, dialog, dialog box that shows up, uh, you need to uh, select the uh, display catalog uh, checkbox uh, and uh, obviously it's going to display the Arasbeam uh, catalog which is mentioned here which is the only uh, dynamic catalog available today. Uh, then you need also to, uh, to specify uh, the uh, interval at which uh, the uh, catalog is going to be updated from the internet. If your uh, computer is not connected to the internet uh, it means of course that that update uh, cannot be uh, done uh, and it will be delayed until your uh, computer is connected to the internet again. If you want to perform uh, a manual update of, of the catalog, all what you need to do is to click the uh, immediate update button and after a few second, seconds, uh, the, um, the, the, the catalog is, is updated within C2A from internet. You close the dialog box and now to make sure that the uh, uh, BE stars from RSBeam are actually displayed, uh, you need to go into the view menu and check that the uh, dynamic catalogs uh, um, item has a check mark, uh, which means that uh, the objects uh, from the uh, dynamic catalogs and the uh, RSBeam catalog in particular are actually displayed into the map. Okay, so here we go. Um, the uh, B stars are in this map, uh, except that they are not really visible because of the uh, profusion of stars from the uh, SAO catalog, which is, as you can see here, the current catalog. And you have uh, quite a large number of stars at that zoom level. So an easy way is to actually hide uh, the uh, um, current uh, star catalog and you do that with this button in the toolbar and now we can see uh, much more easily uh, the uh, BE stars uh, into the map. So as you can see there are uh, red uh, uh, BE stars which means that they need to be uh, urgently observed. Uh, you have uh, green uh, stars which means that uh, they are not so urgent to observe and uh, you have uh, yellow stars, uh, which means that uh, they have an intermediate priority level. So what you can do is simply uh, double click any of these uh, stars and you get all the information uh, about uh, that particular star, including the name, uh, date and uh, time of uh, last observation, the uh, requested observ observation period for uh, that uh, particular object, and the uh, priority level. So let's uh, display again the uh, SAO catalog. Uh, there is a way to highlight actually in the map uh, the BE stars. Uh, you go into the uh, view menu, object tags, and uh, you check the uh, Arasbeam object uh, item. And as you can see, um, a, a small uh, capital A is going to be associated to all the uh, Arasbeam uh, object into the map. There is a second way uh, to uh, highlight uh, the uh, BE stars. Uh, you simply go into the uh, file menu, dynamic catalogs, and here uh, what you do is you uh, use the uh, checkbox highlight object in the map, close the dialog box, and you, as you can see, uh, the BE stars are much more visible uh, because they are uh, put at the top of a small grey disk into the maps. So if you hide again the SAO catalog, as you can see they are clearly visible. You can zoom in and here on the uh, southeast horizon 
you can see uh, what are the uh, most urgent uh, BE stars to observe. Uh, they are displayed in red. In red, I double click this one, and you have all the uh, necessary information about that object and uh, where to observe it. So as you can see, uh, C2A is a very simple uh, tool uh, to view uh, what are the uh, B stars to observe for uh, a spectral observation. And um, it's uh, really uh, easy to use as uh, the uh, database is automatically, automatically downloaded from the uh, internet so that you can uh, easily prepare your observation. Okay, that's it for uh, that tutorial. Uh, I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.